Good morning, children. How are you all? All fine? Yes. Hope you all submitting your class work notes and you are writing your class work notes. We are checking it and we are doing it good, but still some have to improve your handwriting and mistakes. Some spelling mistakes are there. Try to correct it, children. Okay. Okay. So and now today we are going to have our revision class. Now we have started our what unit test, right? Have you all gone through the questions and patterns of the exam? Yes. So we will discuss now about the first we will discuss about what is the question and what is the pattern for our unit test one. We are going to see about our science. What is the pattern for science and what is the pattern for what is the lesson portion for this unit test one in science. Okay children? Yes. So yes see. So in our science we have in our portion for unit one we have in the portion as lesson number one. Only one lesson we are going to write that is living and non-living things. It's our first lesson right children? Yes, what is the name of the first lesson? Living and non-living things. So it is our portion. We are going to write because so we have to read what lesson? First lesson that is living and non-living things. It is very easy, right? Yes, you all have learned about it earlier itself. Yes, now we will revise about it. And the pattern. So pattern in how much marks we are going to write? Totally we are going to write it for 25 marks. Going to write it for how much? 25 marks. So, how we have split it? We check, okay? So, we have three sections that is section A, section B, and section C. C. So, we have three sections. In section A, we have one mark questions. We have one mark questions. In one mark questions, we will be like choose, fill up, match, true or false, whatever, however it be. But each question carries one mark. Each question carries one mark. And how many questions will be having? That is 15 marks. Okay. 15 marks means 15, one mark. So we are going to write 15 questions. So each carries one mark. So that is one mark. So we are going to write for 15 marks. See, in 25 marks, we have one mark itself. Exam. The name of the exam is what? Unit test 
that by hatching them it will give birth to the n one so human being will give birth to n one animals will have they have some types some animals will give birth to n one and some will by laying the eggs and hatching them they will reproduce the n one and plants from plants we get from seeds mostly we are getting the uh, it will reproduce that means we are making the new plant from their seeds only right and some and the uh, rat plants we can by getting the for the stem we can grow a new plant but some but mostly uh, the plants give uh, the new they will reproduce with their seeds so all living things will reproduce human beings by giving birth animals some will give birth and some by laying the eggs and hatching them they will produce the n ones and plants by seeds like uh, in animals itself it will cover insects everything will come birds everything and living things can feed yes as living things as all living things will feed can it will go feed yes human beings we can feed all the things like we touch one thing we can we can able to find whether it is hot cold or what all it is and anything happens we can able to feed all the by how we are feeding it by using the sense organs what the sense organs we are having eyes nose tongue ears and our skin by these we are by eyes we are seeing by nose we are sensing the smell and by the ears we are hearing and by the talk by the tongue we are speaking and we are feeling the taste by the tongue you are feeling the taste and the skin we are feeling uh, it is used to touch okay so we do touch and feel so that is by using the sense of this we are making the feel of human beings and for same animals also by using the sense of this it feels the things around us or changes around us but plants what about plants plants don't have sense of this but it can able to feel yes if, for example touch me not plant if we touch it the leaves will automatically get closed and sun flower when the sun comes it will glow and it will go in the direction of the sun there is no sun it will go down right and lotus like lotus also if sun is sun is there and it leaves something the lily will be there right at the end of the thing it will glow and at the end of it will glow right so like this the plant also will have feelings it can also feel the changes around us and insects animals also like this only so they living things die yes living things can die but non living things cannot die why living things that all living things will have a particular period to live they cannot live for a long so they each like so like grow all living things can grow so they will be having a certain lifetime to grow at the stage so Uh, it will be a kid for if we take human beings the baby will can we can it cannot it will not move up to 6 months and then it start to move step by step at the age of after it one it will walk so likewise mm, the things also in the lifetime also was there for particular lifetime only we can able to live after that they will die right so life span so time period for which a living thing stays alive so the time we can how many days or how many years you are living so for human beings up to 70 years so likewise each in, uh, insects uh, plants everything will be having a particular life span to live so all living things will die but non living things don't have life span it won't die understand so all living things can breathe all living things can move all living things can what reproduce and all living things need food and water to survive and all living things will reproduce all living things will grow and reproduce will grow and all living things will feed so these are the things and we'll continue next about man made things about natural and uh, what is natural thing and what is man made thing we will discuss now so next
things to support man-made things, natural and man-made things. What is natural thing and what is man-made thing? Right, natural means what? Which is already available in our ear. We cannot able to produce it. We cannot able to which is already which is available in the ear. So, recorded things, plants, tree, plants, then sun, sky, cloud, sea, mountains, rivers, everything. Is it all made by man? No, it is all natural thing. So, the, it all, it all, it was already was available in the ear. So, we cannot able to make it. It is a natural thing. Sun is a natural thing. And plant and ear, everything in the universe is all a natural thing. It is already available. So, we cannot able to even plants, animals, human beings, fish, insects, and then reptiles. Everything is everything all natural thing. Man 
and juice and salads everything these are things made by man and gold this is again the nature which is making too jewel for all women and wood for decorative purposes and for doors and uh, many furnitures and paper we are making from wood that is what is a natural thing this uh, door furniture this everything will comes and the man made thing and sand from sand we are making glass and the glass we are making different varieties uh, we are making use of it so glass sand is a natural thing glass is a man made thing and clay clay is a natural thing and for clay plates floor tiles pots cup pots many things we are making from the clay so it is a natural and it is a man made thing so children so far we have discussed initially uh, well again we go for a overview so the things now we see the difference between living and non living things first we start with the brief yes all living things will brief but non living things will not brief then move yes all living things will move non living things will not move then about the earth food all living things need food and water to survive but non living things don't want any food or water to survive so food and water gives energy to the living things then about reproduction all living things will reproduce but non living things will not reproduce and feed up all living things can able to feed with the help of their sense organs but plants don't have sense organs so they can feed okay then after that about their reproduction all living things reproduce by giving birth and some may by laying the eggs they will reproduce but non living things cannot reproduce then will come uh, then die about their life span all living things have some life span uh, so it will grow all living things will grow non living things will not grow uh, the life span all living things will have some life span according to during the time period only it will live and after all living things will die so all living things will die but non living things will don't have life span it won't die it will be as like say up to the earth and what it will come then about man made natural and man made thing so in natural thing what are the natural things animals human beings fish plants and um, sky mountain moon sun this all everything all natural things in natural things will have living and non living and then in man made things we have discussed the things which is available in the nature the man man is making a new thing that is man made thing so in vegetables and fruits and vegetables jam and juice and from wood we are making is making man is making the jewels and from wood we are making different kinds of things so for furniture for decorative purpose for paper for doors everything we are making is wood then sand is a natural thing from that we are making what glass glass materials and clay is a natural thing from the clay uh, floor tiles pots flower pots then plates everything we are making from the clay clay is a natural thing these are things from man made things so these are things children so revise it properly children now we'll discuss some important about important points from this lesson children so how the plants will breathe the plants will breathe the tiny growth present in the leaves called stomata so by that the plants are getting breathe and how the fish breathe is with the help of the gills and what is the movement of um, how the human living things will move by walk by run or the birds can fly so by these movements they can move how the plants will move by uh, by changing by uh, with the help by moving the leaves and examples of movement of plants touch me not plant if we touch it it will close it and the sun flower sun flower when the sun comes it will uh, move according to the sun's direction so this is the example of movement of plants and then man made things we have discussed it. this is the man made things which is natural and 